uh, will there be any difference when um, uh, the HPA goes over with the Public Health England? Um, not that I'm aware of. The decision about screening, which is made by the National Screening Committee, um, they decided initially, when they first looked at this 10 or 12 years ago, that they wouldn't recommend screening, because at that time, the UK had a, a relatively low rate of GBS compared with other countries. And moreover, there wasn't the same evidence of the effectiveness of the screening approach. Of course, since that time, the situation has changed dramatically, and countries that used to have a high rate, like the USA, now have a lower rate, a significantly lower rate than we do. And all these other countries have shown by introducing screening, they've seen these dramatic drops. The problem is that the National Screening Committee um, says, oh, well, there haven't been any randomized trials in the UK. Well, firstly, uh, when something has been demonstrated to work in so many countries, you could actually argue that it's not ethical any longer to do a trial because we know that it works. I can't see any reason why if it works in Belgium and Spain and uh, Italy and Germany, etc., why would it not work in the UK? Um, but this is, this is a bit of a stumbling block that we have at the National Screening Committee, plus the fact I think they find it difficult to change their mind. Having said they didn't agree, they didn't think screening should be introduced. They're going to have to do change that, I think, in the weight of the evidence. Um, and that may, may be where the problem lies. It's difficult for us to know why this problem has arisen, particularly in the UK.